if you had uh, 24 hours to mm. learn a new skill whoa how are you going to go about it how am i going to go about it man bro you didn't tell me you're gonna hit me with some of these deep questions you feel me <laughs> man if, if i had 24 hours to learn a new skill mm -hmm. um i think I, i'll draw from a bit of design thinking here right mm -hmm. there's I, einstein did a quote like if i had uh, if i had 24 hours to basically like solve a problem right he spent 90 percent understanding the problem mm -hmm. and 10 percent on the solution right mm -hmm. for me i probably take the first couple of hours to break apart sub skills mm -hmm. right i mean if you take give me, give me any skill coding coding pff, perfect right mm -hmm. you take coding okay and you say okay fine i want to i want to learn coding in 24 hours right mm -hmm. People just kind of dive right into it. I'll take the time and actually separate it. Okay, what does coding involve? Coding involves some type of math and logic. Mm -hmm. Coding involves some type of programming language. I have to decide which one. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then probably getting familiar with your IDEs, which is your coding environments, mm -hmm. you know, whether it's VS Code or Terminal and so on. So I, I take the time and kind of like break apart everything that is relevant, all the sub skills involved that will help me to be good at this thing. I would then rank these sub skills mm -hmm. in order of what i feel i have a better grasp on or not yeah and then i'd start focusing and putting all my attention in that particular order so if i notice that okay i'm kind of good at math and logic but i'm horrendous with the python syntax or javascript and so on right i'm kind of good with this particular coding environment but i'm bad at creating functions mm -hmm. i put all of this into a ranking system and I start with the one that is most challenging. Mm -hmm. I